Hey guys, I wanted to film quickly, as quickly as I can, what I'm bringing to Disney World, my toiletry bag, makeup and skincare. I feel like a lot of these products, if you are familiar with my videos, will not come as a shock to you. I had some requests on Instagram when I shared that I did it, the outfits that I was bringing. I had a lot of people ask if I could do one for my toiletries. So these are some of my favorite videos to watch. Hopefully you guys enjoy this. I'll have all the products linked below. I'm gonna try to run through them pretty quickly because I still need to edit this video and get it scheduled. It's the day before we leave, so I'm like crunch time, but I really wanted to get this video filmed. So let me show you what I'm taking along. My toiletry bag is the same one I usually travel with, and I love this bag. I think it was sent to me from Benefit. It was part of like a PR package. It's pretty old, but I love it because it's clear, it's wipeable, I can see everything, and it closes up really nicely and also lays flat, so makes traveling and like finding your things really easy. I hope I'm not blowing you out, that might be better. Okay, so I'll go through this first, um, and then I'll show you what I have over here. So one side I reserve for skin, and one side I reserve for makeup. So the first thing I'm bringing, these are these Psycho Pair Tiger, Tiger Grass Night Repair Masks, and you put these on over top your moisturizer. I never know when my skin's gonna be dry, so I grabbed a bunch of these, and then I also grabbed 10 of these Dr. Dennis Gross Alpha Beta exfoliating pads. I love my facial radiance pads, but these are a lot more travel friendly. All right, so this is a replenished oil. You can use this as a nighttime moisturizer or mix it in with your moisturizer. So I'm also bringing along the skin recovery cream from Dermalogica. This isn't typically my nighttime moisturizer, but I'm not bringing my big one, and I like to just travel with like travel size products. To take off my makeup, I'm taking Skin Fix's Foaming Oil Cleanser. This is actually what I use right now, daily. And they sent me like a little travel size, which is really convenient. I literally just filmed the entire section, taking everything out and showing you, and just realized it wasn't recording. <laughs> So now I'm gonna pack back up the bag and I'll show you as we go. I'm having trouble with the products focusing, but I'm gonna tell you what everything is and I'll link it below. I apologize, but I'll have to like focus each product and that'll take so long. So I cleanse with my skin resurfacing cleanser from Dermalogica. It's got lactic acid in it. And although I don't have a travel size, I cannot be without it. I also am bringing my little Foreo. I'm obsessed with this. It came in my FabFitFun box. This is my serum. This is the Snow Mushroom. Water Serum by Volition. I don't want to be without that either. It's super hydrating and amazing. Also bringing a little Kate Somerville Exfolicate. I like to do this treatment on my face like twice a week. It's a really good exfoliation. Bringing as my body moisturizer by Elsie Organics, her uplifting massage oil. This is really hydrating and I'm gonna have a spray tan so I'm gonna need to keep my skin really hydrated. The Surf Spray by Bumble and Bumble. I don't ever do my hair without this. I have Lash Bath. This is what I use to clean my lash extensions and also my brush for that. My Origins Tinted Moisturizer. Don't want to ever go anywhere without that. Psycho Pair, a little baby size. My nighttime and daytime eye under eye moisturizer. This is amazing from Dermalogica. And with that, I also top it with the Color Science 3 in 1. This is a brightener and um, it is like a treatment for your under eyes. So that's kind of like daytime. Also my Schmitz Rose and Vanilla Deodorant, a little baby dry shampoo from Elizabeth and James, a fresh sugar lip treatment. I don't ever go to bed without something on my lips. So that's all on this side. Okay, that's skincare. So moving on to foundations and makeup, I already showed but it didn't record. So I'm taking my Sephora airbrush foundation. This is my favorite, and this would be the only one I'm taking, but I'm scared I'm gonna run out, so I'm bringing also my Dermablend Smooth Camo Liquid Foundation. I don't see myself wearing makeup, like especially to the parks every day, so for that reason, I'm bringing my Charlotte Tilbury Flawless Face Filter. I have my Origins Mousse Primer. My primer spray, I don't like putting on a primer if I have a lot of like moisturizer and tint of moisturizer on, so I like the primer spray. I have a little bit, a little pack of these little Invisibobbles for my hair. Tarte Shape Tape Concealer. Beauty Blender. My little bottom lash mascara. I have lash extensions, so I'm not bringing any um, mascara for my lashes. I have a bunch of Buxom lip glosses, and I have four more downstairs. These are the only lip products I'm bringing. Dragon Fruit by Becca. This is a, an amazing cream blush, and I just 
I think with it being so hot in Florida, I'll probably wear this a lot during the days. Urban Decay All Nighter Spray to set everything. I have a solid blender, blender cleanser um, to clean my beauty blender and brushes. I'm only bringing two blushes. I'm bringing NARS Madly, which works as a bronzer, like a, a rosy bronze, and Deep Throat. I have a little baby Hourglass Luminous Powder, a little baby Translucent Set Powder from Laura Mercier, a Gimme Brow from my eyebrows. The bronzer I'm bringing is So Ceylon from MAC. It's my favorite. And then I'm also bringing um, Under Eye, what is this called? Bye Bye Under Eye from IT Cosmetics Concealer for my face, and then the Hourglass Ambient Lighting Palette. Bringing my Tom Ford Body Spray in the Neroli Portofino. I love this stuff, especially if you don't want to wear like perfume during the day. This is amazing. That is all packed up. And then the only other thing I'm bringing is this old Ellen Dot Poof, and this is my daily SPF. I have the Dermalogica Pure Light, and this is really great for um, melasma and like hyperpigmentation, and it's SPF 50. And then this is an invisible powder. So I plan on actually using this, like carrying this with me in the park just to reapply my, my sunscreen throughout the day without smearing this if I am wearing makeup. So these are gonna be daily. And then I also have shampoo and conditioner. I'm using the Living Proof Perfect Hair Day. These aren't my favorite. You guys know I love the Alterna, but I had these and they're travel size, so I'm bringing them. And then perfumes. I'm bringing Elizabeth and James Amethyst. This is more of like a nighttime. And I'm only bringing two bottles. The um, Soleil Blanc from Tom Ford. This is an amazing like beachy scent. I kind of have been wearing this and cheating on Bronze Goddess, don't tell. And then this one, this is like so nostalgic. I actually first bought this in Disney World in Italy inside Epcot and it remains one of my very favorite perfumes and every time I smell it, I think of Disney World so I couldn't not bring this. I'm sorry if I rushed through that. Like I said, I still need to get this on my computer and edit it, but a lot of those products, probably all of those products, you knew I was bringing. So I hope you guys enjoyed seeing this. I hope you found it helpful if you were packing or deciding what to bring. I love the little checkout aisle at Sephora. They have so many of those like travel size, baby travel size packaging, which I love. And a lot of those are some of my favorite products that I use daily. So I love that they come in like little miniature form. So that's just a little idea. I also have those little like silicone bottles that you can put shampoos and stuff in. So that's another option. And I've seen them at TJ Maxx. I got a set from Sephora, but I hope that this video was helpful. And thank you guys for watching. Bye.